Hi, I'm Alan Creighton with Novalite Telecom Supply. Novalite's a national distributor of fiber optic cable and OSP materials for fiber optic networks. Today we're going to talk a little bit about handholes. Handholes basically an underground vault that allows you to have access to your fiber optic cable for, or other utilities for splicing and repairs. Virtually every handhole, like you see here, is, has no bottom in it, and that allows for you to bring your uh, fiber optic cable or telecommunications cable up through the bottom and allows water to drain out. There's four basic things you need to consider when ordering a handhole. It's the size of the handhole, the material of the handhole, the tier rating, and the shape. There's four basic materials that handholes are made out of. We have your traditional polymer concrete handhole, you have your, uh, a fiberglass reinforced polymer handhole, we have advanced composite material handhole, and we have an HDPE handhole. Today, our sales manager, Jason Johnson, is going to tell you a little bit about each of these handholes and the various benefits of the handholes. Hi there. This is a traditional polymer concrete handhole, and it is uh, the heaviest for its size. Polymer concrete handholes are the heaviest for their size. It's made of sand, aggregate, and a bonding material, typically resin. These can be used for incidental traffic applications like telecom or cable TV or other utilities and in commercial and industrial projects. This handhold was manufactured by New Basis and it weighs about, or weighs 342 pounds. It does require a backhoe and a crew to set and move. And these, this type of handhold, polymer concrete handholds, have been around for a long time. They're, they're known for being very durable and cost effective. This is a fiberglass reinforced polymer handhold, or FRP. And FRP uses a high strength fiberglass and resin instead of sand and aggregate around the, the base, at the base of the box. This makes for a lighter weight handhold, even in the larger sizes. These FRP boxes are typically uh, composed of a bonded, or, I'm sorry, F FRP bonded to a traditional polymer concrete uh, support ring and lid. So the, the support ring that you see at the top and the lid are, are made out of the same material as the polymer concrete handle over here. This handle was manufactured by Martin Industries and weighs about 220 pounds. It can be moved by two people, but it still requires a crew and a, possibly a backhoe to set. The third type of handhole we're gonna look at today is an advanced composite handhole. It's the least common of the materials of handholes that we sell. This individual handhole was manufactured by Charles Industries and it's lightweight. The, the handhole and the lid weigh only 116 pounds. It's easy to manage by two people and doesn't require heavy equipment to deploy. An interesting fact about this is it, this unit, the entire unit is stackable. So if you ship it internationally, you can save significantly on shipping. Uh, they, the boxes stack on top of each other. The fourth type of handhole that we're going to look at today is high density polyethylene or HDPE. HDPE handholes are the lightest weight handholes we have available, and they weigh 50 to 75 percent less than the traditional polymer concrete handholes. This handhole is manufactured by Channel and weighs only 105 pounds. Very easy to move and deploy. It makes it uh, easy for two people to put this in the back of a pickup truck. It doesn't require any heavy equipment to install, and despite its weight, it's still constructed to have a Tier 22 rating. These are also HDPE boxes, and the HDPE can be used to make smaller handholes for water meters, sprinkler junctions, and typically these smaller boxes are used in fiber to the home deployments. Uh, there's two basic shapes of handholes, round or rectangular. Most of our customers in the telecom industry use a rectangular uh, handhold, and they come in many different sizes, ranging from 12 by 12 by 12 inches up to a, a 48 by 60 by 48 inches. The most basic sizes of handholds that we sell are a 17 by 30 by 24, a 24 by 36 by 24, and a 48 by 36 by 36. The lead times for handholds in the U.S. is typically four to six weeks, but it can be as much as eight to 12 weeks during the uh, peak building season. But as you can see, Novalite carries many different sizes and shapes of handholds in stock for immediate delivery. We hope this video has been helpful. We invite you to call us at 706-301-9046 to get expert advice on the proper handhold for your application. You can also visit our website at www.novalite.com where we've developed a custom configurator that allows you to put your specifications and needs in there and then we can develop a 
quote, custom quote for your application.